you guys currently have a rule in place governing a, an administrative rule in place governing what you're going to review and what you're not going to review. If you don't think it's appropriate to be reviewing certain crimes for applications, why are why are you not su uh, submitting an administrative rule change? I mean, that would probably go to my committee for review for the review. I mean, I, I can't speak for other committee members, but if it's a reasonable change, I would probably pass it along through my committee relatively quickly. I do have a recognition that there are there are right there are statutory <coughs> requirements and then there are rule requirements and. And, and, and I, I have to say that that's kind of uh, the next level of my work in terms of what I see uh, to move the agency forward. I, I know our staff uh, certainly led, as, as uh, Attorney Norberg had mentioned, certainly led a review of the administrative rules and statutes. Um, the, the recommendations uh, coming out of that review were, um, or, or the, I should say, the, the impetus for the review was to say, we're only going to review those things that we're required to, to absolutely review. Um, my understanding was that it was a statutory requirement. If, if the uh, Legislative Council has a different opinion of that, we'd love to get our attorneys together with your attorneys and have that discussion and make sure that if there's a rule we can move forward on, let's absolutely do it. Is your department's contention that it's for those specific those specific uh, occupations that we, that we have to change this legal review issue? Or is it for all of them? Because my understanding was it was the application of that, that, the statute that she just said, 440, and then the, your rule that you promulgated under 440, why you have to review basically everything. For those professions um, that identify um, crimes or conviction record review in their statute, and referencing back to the Fair Employment Act, that those don't uh, include review of ordinance violations. However, some professions, um, their statutes and regulations require review of any violation of law, which does include ordinance violations. So, um, you know, we, we've talked about legislative changes in the past, but in the meantime, you know, we have conducted research and implemented uh, new processes in, to improve efficiencies.